Hi viewers, welcome to LMS Solution. Today we are going to see about uh, GA20PA controller for a two area system using MATLAB something. GA anything but a genetic algorithm uh, it having different kind of operators like selection, uh, crossover, mutation and uh, reproduction right. So these are the basic operators in GA. So by using the GA how we can uh, tune that controller uh, parameter like a professional gain and integral gain for the two area power system so first you have to see what basic about that two area system so here you can see the basic detail um, how the two area is connected here right So here you can see that uh, it having two areas. So this is area one, and this is area two. So the both area going to be connected by means of uh, a tie line. So this is the modeling of tie line. Okay. So by using the tie, tie line, we are going to connect this area one, area two to etching the power between uh, these two area based upon the load demand. Okay. And then these two, uh, that means each area having uh, governor, a uh, turbine, and a uh, generator load motor or rotating mass load motor. Okay. Uh, so here we have that model. Uh, so this is a basic model without any controller. Uh, it having two area. So area one having this kind of transfer function for a governor, turbine, and a generator load model. So same thing uh, here we are implemented here okay and then this area to having different uh, governor turbine and uh, generator load model and then here you can see that so we implemented the same kind of the transfer function and then move on to uh, suppose uh, here we are not using that controller so you have to check the result now so this is the result you are getting for a uh, that mean omega del omega 1 del omega 2 so here you can see that so the, we will get the same result because we are not using any controller for control that uh, del omega and del omega 2 and then uh, this is pm1 pm2 del pm1 del pm2 and then uh, del p uh, 1 2 so that when tie line power so here you can see that so this result uh, both are same right so here we are not using any controller so next to move on to here they are using controller integral controller okay so this is structure when we have to use a controller area controller or minimization right so here they are using that uh, PA controller so the gain of uh, sorry integral controller the gain of integral controller is 0.3 okay so here I'm going to use uh, integral controller with the gain 0 0.3 and here also I'm going to use integral controller with the gain 0 0.3 so let me see the result here I am going to select this one so this is the result we are getting so here you can see that so you will get the same result right and then here you can see that undershoot is around uh, minus 14 the overshoot here is around uh, 2 into 10 power minus 3 ok and then so this is a response of uh, pm1 pm2 and uh, adult p12 so for integral controller so if next time I am going to use here uh, uh, PA controller in both area and then this uh, PA controller will be uh, controlled and be tuned by means of uh, uh, GA algorithm. So here you can see that so this is a code we are using for implementing GA so this is an option. Uh, for implementing GA genetic algorithm and then this is known as uh, uh, 
the main objective function so here we are measuring the uh, IAE, ISC, ITAE, ITSC for both area so based upon that value we have to optimize the value for KPKA, KD so KPKA uh, for two area so here I am going to simulate this one so the GA will be optimized the system here you can see that so here I consider 10 population and 10 uh, iteration so here you can see that for every iteration you will see the, uh, the fitness function uh, in detail so here you can see that after uh, third iteration the effects that the fitness function change from 2.3 to 1.003 okay so every iteration it will be a uh, change the value of kp1 K, ka1 k 2 uh, kp2 and then here you can see the after sixth iteration the fitness function change from 1.003 to 0 0.99 so after seventh iteration here you can see that uh, that uh, fitness function change from 0 0.99 sound to 0 0.8991 okay so after iteration completion right uh, you, you can see that value of uh, uh, kpka so this is value of kpka kp2 and k2 okay so this value will be used here and finally we will get the response like this okay so here you can see that uh, uh, that mean there is reduction in the undershoot and then uh, it improve the settling time of uh, and del omega 1 del omega 2 okay so this is a response of del pm1 and del pm2 okay so so this uh, uh, that main application of ga for tuning of uh, parameter of field controller into the report system so thanks for watching our videos kindly subscribe our channel and also click bell icon for notification about upcoming videos thank you thank you so much bye bye